right, Miss Mary Beth Bailey in here with us this morning. I want to introduce you to her, and how are you? I'm good. How about yourself? I'm doing great. Now, she is a counselor. She's already been bombarded with questions. You know, Jamie, <laughs> Jamie did that Dear Abby just a minute ago, and... You know, dear Jamie, sorry, if, you, if you've been in the family for 30 years and your son and the new wife don't come visit the parents, it's okay. No, it ain't. And you did agree with that, so, hmm, until Jamie kept on and kept on and made you not agree. <laughs> now, you also, I have to say, not a very good counselor because you said there weren't a lot of sick people no. here this morning. I said, for my initial assessment, <laughs> I'd have to spend a little bit more time probably before I could say for sure. <laughs> oh, well, great. We'll let you talk to Jamie after this show. All right, well, we are talking about foster care parenting, and that would be difficult for me because I think if I had a child in the house, for, well, I know if I had a child in the house, I would get so attached. Right. What do you tell foster care parents? Um, you know, Gloria, it's kind of a difficult thing. I mean, a lot of times, you know, especially on the age of the child, it mm -hmm. is, you know, easy to get attached to them. But, you know, first and foremost, what we're looking for is we have these kids that need a home. And if these parents can at least offer it just for a little bit, and then if they do end up having to go back to their biological parents, that's one thing, you know, adoption always is, an, is, a, is a possibility. So um, anyone that's interested, it's at least worth a shot to see. I mean, you may get attached, you may not get attached, but it's at least worth opening your heart, opening your home to these children. What are some of the guidelines? I know you said, congratulations, you've been married two weeks. Yay! <laughs> and I hate to say this, but she said, well, I just got married for the first time. <laughs> I was like, don't say it like that. <laughs> but, Being optimistic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll have to talk about that, too. Um, when they come in, what are, what are you looking for? Are you, you're not looking for single parents or single singles, rather. You are looking for families. No, they can be single. Um, okay. Basically, there's you know two large requirements that you're 25 years old, at least, mm -hmm. and that you can pass a criminal background check. Anybody that meets those requirements, whether you're single, whether you're married, give us a call. Um, um, you can call this number that's right here on the um, poster right here. one eight 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 my yv kid which is Youth Village Kid. Great. And I'll have this on our website, too. There you go. What are some things that, okay, if you're going to keep them or say I'm interested in adopting a child, mm -hmm. do I try to go into foster care and parenting first? Um, I would just say anybody that has room in their home and room in their heart for a child, um, whether you're looking to adopt in the long term, that you should most definitely look into foster care. It's a good way to get started um, and maybe that you might go the adoption route or you might re decide to remain a foster parent. Where are you located? We are located in Huntsville and Madison, um, but we are all throughout North Alabama. So if you are watching in any of this viewing area, you can become a foster parent anywhere in North Alabama. We're in Lauderdale County, we're in Madison County, Limestone County, um, any of the Decatur area. So, but our office is out of Huntsville, but anywhere in North Alabama, you can become a foster parent. Now, all you have to do is pass a criminal background. Well, there's, be there's a few other requirements, okay. um, but those are the two basic requirements. Drug tests would be my number one thing I would be on my list. Yes. I, think, so I didn't want anyone out there to think that. that, that I, you know, there's several um, requirements, but those are the two basic requirements. Okay. If you're watching this and you meet those two requirements, I would like for you to give me a call and we could speak about the other smaller requirements. Okay, well, great. Well, welcome to the show. Her first time seeing the show, so hope you've had a good time. It's wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you, Mary Beth. Thank and I'll you. have that information, too. If you need to get in touch with Mary, Be Mary Beth, I'll be happy to pass that along. All right. Quick break. When we get back, we're going to talk about fat and muscle. Hmm. And we have a young man in here that I just asked if he was on steroids, and he said no. <laughs> he gets asked that quite a bit. You'll meet him in just a moment. Stay with us. Mm -hmm. 